Well, Aloha Canada, because if I don't say Aloha, this guy will straighten me out like BJ Penn usually straightens me out. But Yancey Medeiros is here. Uh, great fight on Saturday night. Can't wait for it to go down. Well, let's go back to the last fight. What are some of the lessons learned in that scrap there? Because obviously it didn't go your way, but you still looked okay. Yeah, oh, uh, hesitation. I hesitated on the moment when Jim Miller pulled that guillotine on me. I was, I was just caught off guard, caught me off experience, and I learned a lot from that fight off that loss. Now you're coming into this fight here, you're, we're, we're in Sacramento, California, not too far from Hawaii uh, when you think about it, but uh, it's a bit of a trek, but at the same time, uh, a lot of people are keeping an eye on you in this division, uh, and I know Joe Silva and Sean Shelby are keeping an eye on you because they wouldn't have put you in against Jim Miller if they didn't believe in you, uh, but you still have a tough opponent, not many people know about him. You give us your thoughts on him. He's tough, he's a good wrestler, he's got a great record, and you know I'm ready to show him that he's welcoming him to the UFC with some fists and elbows. It doesn't surprise me whatsoever, so let me ask you this question. What is your perfect fight on Saturday night? Do you want to be a quick one, one-rounder? Do you want to show skills in 15 minutes? What's your perfect fight? Perfect fight is a fight with me coming with a win, with a finish. Yes. Anyway, from first round, third round, no decision. Got to be a finish. Got to be a finish. All right, main event. Uh, three months ago, TJ Dillashaw shocked the mixed martial arts world. Destroying, I mean, dominating Hayden Burrow in a fashion that not many people could have predicted unless you were part of Team Alpha Male. Now they do the rematch on Saturday night. Uh, your thoughts on what can we expect from those two guys in the octagon? I feel Hayden will be a bit more adjusted to the fight, but TJ Dillashaw is going to pull it off. He's going to take that win. He's going to utilize his speed like he did that last fight. And I believe that this rematch is good, is, is the real match now because Hayden knows what to expect. All his rematches are always like that. So, but TJ is going to pull it off. Well, the rematch is the funny question uh, in this room right now because I'm asking a bunch of people, in terms of an immediate rematch, agree or disagree? The guy got dominated, but he was also on a nine-year win streak. It's, it's tough to say. Uh, the Ramsey Ninja was smart. He said, this is a business. It's money. This, this is going to sell tickets. What are your thoughts on, on an immediate rematch? That's exactly how I feel, you know, and like I said, the rematch is where they both know each other now and they both know their styles and they can, that's where they re it really shows as a martial artist, as a fighter, if you're ready for that you can make the adjustment to win and i don't think i don't th i don't feel that Hen um Hennen's gonna make that adjustment to pull off that win off of dillashaw listen thank you very much for your time i want to wish you the best of luck on saturday night thank you